Material. Welcome back once again, Total Spine video series. Now during a lot of these videos, we're talking about a, a number of different conditions and then how chiropractic treatment can conservatively uh, benefit those individuals. So today, we're gonna talk about what's called spondylolisthesis, okay? And that's literally when the vertebrae is shifted forward or slipped forward in relation to the vertebrae's ne the vertebrae next to it, all right? So, and, the, and this is important because I've had a few different patients in this week um, that they came up with con this condition, they, they've tried different treatment options, they want to avoid a surgery, um, and chiropractic can really, really benefit them. Now obviously, there's an underlying structural problem there that we can't necessarily fix, but we can get a, a, a considerable amount of pain relief. So when I say, when we talk about spinal thesis, like I said, it's, it's slipping forward. It's this vertebrae literally moving forward in most cases, it can also also slip backwards, but moving forward, okay, anterior spondylolisthesis, meaning it went in that direction, okay. Now, there's a number of different things that can cause this. Many are congenital, where the the posterior aspects of this bone don't form correctly, and as a result, that vertebrae can move. All right. There's things such as degeneration when this disc breaks down, that can also cause things to move as the biomechanics of the joint change. All right. Uh, another third one is a is a pathological change that can occur. All right, maybe there's a tumor that's eaten away at a portion of this vertebrae. All right, so those are really the big three. Um, also, you can have something like a trauma where the pars interarticularis portion of this of the of the back of this bone actually cracks and breaks as well, allowing that vertebrae to slip forward. So there's a number of things going on here, and really the best way to see this and diagnose it is by taking a quality quality X-ray. Now you can do the most thorough examination in the world and you can have an idea of what's going on, but unless you actually take a picture of it, there, there's no way to know for sure what the, the underlying structure of that spine looks like. So that's why we always want to take quality films before we use any of our techniques. That way I know I'm comfortable um, with, the, with the technique I'm going to use in, in administering care to that patient. So um, now the focus of chiropractic, always we want to realign joints realign the spine so that it's functioning properly, um, the biomechanics are proper, and also with an instability injury, now there's there's really four grades of this. So it just depends on how far that bone has actually slipped forward. There's five grades um, all the way to the front, and then the fifth would actually be when that bone slips off the front, all right? So now some of the more extreme ones, these the threes, the fours, most likely you're gonna require some surgery, but there are still some things we can do conservatively. We can make adjustments. Now while we're on this, the most common levels to have this, L4, L5, L5, S1 in the lumbar spine. So we wanna make sure that we get below that to not push that vertebrae forward anymore. So we wanna be on the sacrum, and then also we wanna, we wanna really take a look at T12, L1, because that's where that spinal cord ends, so any stimulation we can get to those nerves going down through L4 or 5 are going to be huge and they'll pay off huge dividends down the road. Also, we want to do some things to open up discs, all right, take pressure off nerves, and then there should be some strengthening going on around there too to do as much as we can around, uh, uh, specifically with that core, to strengthen around and hold that vertebrae from moving any further forward, okay? now. If, if you or anybody you know is suffering from this type of condition, or maybe you're curious, maybe there's things that you've, your low back pain or different symptoms you've been experiencing that you haven't been able to figure out why, come in, get checked out, we'll be able to give you some answers and at least let you know if there's a conservative treatment method that will benefit you. So give us a call, 763-568-7869. We're always here, always waiting to help you uh, and your family. Take your health and your life to the next level and be your best.